Welcome back, everybody. According to the Centers for Disease Control, suicide is the tenth leading cause of death in America. Torch City Cable reporter Michael Patterson finds out how local schools and organizations are partnering up to raise awareness and change that statistic one walk at a time. For a long, long time, suicide was not talked about. You know, it was just either they didn't talk about it at all or people felt ashamed. We want people to be able to talk about it and look at each other and say, you know, we, we're not alone. Amy Robinson is a board chair of the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention's LA and Central Coast chapter, and she uses her own struggles with suicide to try and help others. I actually attempted suicide two times in 2007, um, so my speech is all about um, how I recovered from that, and hopefully the goal of that speech is to give hope to other people that may struggle. I hope that we can bring hope to people and healing to people that may have lost someone to suicide. For the first time, the South Bay Association of School Psychologists teamed up with the foundation to host the South Bay Campus Walk at Torrance High School. One of hundreds of walks that took place recently aimed at raising awareness for suicide prevention. To those who have joined us today in memory of someone who has lost their battle to mental health, thank you for being here. Organizers say events like these help reduce the stigmas surrounding mental health. It also provides a space for people to find others that have similar experiences and realize that they are not alone. Isolation is such a huge part of uh, suicidality and so knowing that there are people in support of such an issue and that um, there is a way out of it I think is, is uh, a huge benefit to those people. One of the big aspects about this event is this colored bead table, which you can see right behind me. It allows patrons at this event to come and wear colored beads like the ones I've got around my neck that can help find other people that have gone through the same experiences that they have. Each walk has an honor bead ceremony, and each bead necklace has a symbolic meaning in terms of one's relationship to suicide. Robinson hopes that this South Bay campus walk becomes a yearly trend. We want to help people understand that it is preventable. I hope that people feel empowered to talk about mental health issues um, and that people that may need help, that they feel safe enough to talk to people about mental health. For Torrance City Cable, I'm Michael Patterson. Thanks, Michael. The foundation hopes to reduce the national suicide rate by 20% in the next six years. If you or someone you know is struggling with thoughts of suicide, you can call the National Suicide Prevention Hotline at 1-800-273-8255 or text TALK to 741-741. Children and teens are building self-esteem while they learn how to combat bullying without getting physical. There we go. 